6.5 radius so in this way these are the different data types in autolis then arithmetic functions so arithmetic functions are different item arithmetic functions are there that will be useful so first is very basic that is a plus is making sum of given numbers so uh, the style is the same suppose i will uh, just erase this so uh, every time auto lift statement will start with left bracket then i will give a plus then i will i can make the sum of suppose two variables i have, I have two variables that is no and length then closing bracket and enter so in this way it has made a sum of 20.5 and uh, 5 so it is 20.5 uh, and 5 that is become 25.5 so in this way whatever variables we have created above that we made sum of that or you can take any numbers also suppose if i say i want to make sum of something like this or it can be more than two also so it has written me the sum of those numbers and I can store this again I can store this value in a variable also suppose I want to store the sum of these two in some variable called sum suppose set q so I will say again set q to where set the value to the variable I have to use set q variable name is sum then I am telling here I want to make the sum of no and length variable and store in sum so if I press enter so I can check the value of sum also if I check the value of sum so sum has been uh, so in this way you can create the formulas and use it so this is the first arithmetic function same way you can make the subtraction also you just give minus give the number that you want to minus same way you can do multiplication using star same way you can do the dividation using slash suppose i want to say 20 divided 25 divided by 2 so here only you have to keep in mind at the time of dividation one number should be a real number otherwise if you see here the answer is wrong so answer should be 20.5 so here one number should be always real number so i will say 2.0 suppose so we got the correct answer so at the time of dividation you have to keep in mind that the you should uh, one number should be a real number otherwise the answer will become wrong so in this way we have uh, used the standard arithmetic function then you can uh, use the cos function for angle uh, cos function for calculating the cos value sine function is there log is there then base and power you can calculate so the method is same for all of those functions so only the angle should be in radian that you have to keep in mind whatever angle you pass to uh, cos or sine or whenever in auto lifts the angle must be in radian that you have to keep in mind so in this way you can use different arithmetic functions so in this way we will stop here our first lecture thanks for joining